Welcome to exciting times. A time to celebrate 35 years of our journey as Praj. We are ready with greener solutions for tomorrow. That spring from technology are ecologically sound and economically profitable. Today as Praj stands ready to take off with the bio economy of tomorrow. We feel the same excitement, nervousness, anxiety as we have so many times before. None of us shall never ever forget the night before Praj went public in January 1994. 25 years ago, we were a 10-year-old engineering company with ambitious growth plans. The IPO proved to be the moment of our own twist with our destiny. From the earliest days, competition from MNCs loomed large. To deal with this challenge, a technology partner had to be identified. We managed to arrange a loan of rupees one lakh just to travel to Austria and finalize a tie-up. At the same time, almost Praj independently developed the Sprani, an innovative, integrated, effluent technology for distilleries. But Sprani absorbed. all available funds an article about icici venture capital came to promotes attention in those days institutions offering venture capital investments were not very common sprani satisfied icici's experts they sanctioned conditional loan cum equity thus a fortuitous meeting of minds resulted the icici arrangement was for us a validation a shot in the arm an encouragement at just the critical moment soon there was no looking back praj established a strong position in the chosen domain of core competence distilleries with technology inputs and infrastructure elements in place the company needed major funding to achieve its dreams this was to be found by going to the investing community with an IPO the IPO was a bold step which the management took with some trepidation we adopted a new corporate identity dynamic and professional everything was well thought through necessary publicity and road shows had been organized but still the night before the praj IPO was filled with niggling doubts would public involvement bring unknown challenges would people accept an engineering company so young with its plans but hard work always pays off the praj share was offered at premium price and yet it got oversubscribed seven times over and such a fearless approach of seeking public funding has become a recognized entrepreneurial norm since In the post IPO era with the first offshore office at Singapore the expanded Praj started serving international clients in the ASEAN region 25 years since the IPO we have paid dividends 20 times of which 15 consecutively and now the future looks promising yet again major oil companies seek to sign contracts with us for development of second generation ethanol bio refineries in a very conducive climate and positive government support with these plants you have the ability to credibly do that so i am always hopeful of praj so. <laughs> however it has not been a smooth ride by any means when we were progressing along nicely an unexpected challenge appeared in the form of asian flu in 1998 the asian recession struck the overall market filling every night with sleepless anxiety while everyone else was scaling down businesses cutting costs reducing manpower praj chose to embark on a strategic course correction looking to new geographies the proven competencies of praj and insights acquired at harvard business school gave promote the unerring vision 
to move the company to the next higher orbit of operations at global level. This leap of faith was made possible in large part because of our core strength, our technology. To be successful in any competitive market, one must become technologically self-reliant. This requires backward integration upstream to the source and ability to offer one's own technology. As a technology-driven company, Praj had started a small in-house R&D center at a very early stage. Along with alcohol, we accurately sensed the potential of ethanol as a very promising alternate source of energy for transportation. Research in ethanol technology and offering end-to-end -end ethanol technology solutions became the basis for the company's successful, sustainable business model as globally ethanol mandates were creating a positive ground for business. By collaborating with an American dehydration technology company, we made a clean sweep in India for ethanol plants. Along with ethanol plants, our own brainchild Smart Distilleries helped us cross the 1 billion rupees revenue mark early in the new millennium. The technology bias adopted during the strategic course correction, buttressed by strong R&D backup, was vindicated when Praj achieved 100% share of ethanol sector in faraway Colombia. By 2008, our R&D department transmuted into Praj Matrix, a future-ready, award-winning research center for advanced research in ethanol and biorefinery chemicals based on sustainability and innovation. It is also equipped with a pilot plant for second-generation ethanol production from a variety of agri-residue. Our strength in ethanol technology resulted in bagging the order for biggest bioethanol plant in UK. The order and its magnitude brought Praj swiftly to the notice of European market. Nothing succeeds like success. This is reflected in numerous national and international awards that have come in as a strong recognition of our tireless efforts from the industry we serve, from entities we help, from people whose life we touched for the better. With our performance and our very marked interest in green fuels very early on, we even got the attention of eminent value investors like Rakesh Junjunwala and venture capitalist Vinod Khosla. Others stalwarts in their own fields support, guide and inspire us. Recently, at a gala event in Singapore, Praj Industries and also our leader, Mr. Pramod Chaudhary, were recognized as Asia's Greatest Brands and Leaders 2018, respectively. We are proud of our latest laurel wreath. We insist on expressing gratitude to our stakeholders, both shareholders and partners. Our dear Prajites, all of whom have given us unstinted support all along. An ESOP for Praj employees was launched and the Praj family of shareholders grew again. The investment opportunity brought financial stability to many. As in a family, we support each other to success. Five years ago, on our Pearl anniversary, we unveiled our new brand identity and shifted our headquarters to Praj Tower to cater to our ever-increasing team of professionals. Long before CSR became a government requirement, we had taken our corporate responsibility very seriously. We continue to give back to society via our vigorous CSR calendar. The Praj Foundation has completed commendable initiatives and projects in health, education and environment. All our business verticals cater to needs of global customers in their respective industries. Years later, 
by dint of continuous excellence praj stands at pole position to seize opportunities in the emerging bio economy today many countries in the world use ethanol blended fuel india has started with 10% and aspires to increase that figure to 20% by 2022 expected demand at that time will be around 10 billion liters of ethanol per year we offer second generation integrated bio refinery for renewable fuels and chemicals this refinery enhances energy security and moves india towards self reliance in energy All these developments envisaged years ago confirm Prad's leadership position in the bioenergy space. Along with first and second generation ethanol, we are also ready with another vertical for a renewable alternative to transport fuel, CBG, compressed biogas. The government of India has recently launched Satat, an initiative to establish over 5000 cbg plants in the next 5 years india is an agri economy with enormous potential for agri processing to flourish the scope therefore is staggering so after 35 eventful years here we are at what is truly yet another take off point giving us an opportunity to share with you all a attitude of gratitude there are reasons to smile all around for our investors promising value returns on their successful participation for our farmers the promise of sustainable increased income for our society there are increased employment possibilities for our nation youth savings on oil imports for our future generations we shall leave behind a less polluted greener planet today is always the yesterday of a brighter tomorrow now is the moment to spring forward again it is the beginning of a promising bio economy it is praj oh, oh.